Hey everyone, welcome to another one, no, zero evidence one, not one. <laughs> I haven't played one evidence in a while, actually. I don't know why, zero evidence is fun. I know it's not 100% accurate, but that's fine for me. Okay, basement, photo of the girls, damn it. Motion sensor, firelight. And I have to close my window now, for sure. <laughs> oh, look at this, it looks so beautiful. But moonlight is actually white and not bluish. As far as I know, and I've been out in the darkness pretty often with the moon shining. Well, let's hop into Willow. Okay, pick up the key, turn on the lights, and... I won't be able to see the bone on my way, unfortunately. I can just crawl and hope I tumble over it. Let's go to the basement immediately. Sorry for the dark mode again. There will be light soon. Don't worry, guys. And we're gonna search this place from bottom to top. Because the boy kills you. <laughs> Okay, nothing here. Let's hop into this one. Mm -hmm. Nothing out of place, no noises. Close it. Oh, that's some weird lighting. <laughs> See that? <laughs> okay, let's check this room. Bony pants, no noises. Okay, that's it for the basement. Unfortunately, we might have to come back down here again for the breaker. We don't have a hiding spot there, which is unfortunate. Please don't tell me this hiding spot is it. Oh, I hate this one. Why do you give me this one? I hate this hiding spot. I won't use that. I. I refuse. I'd rather hide in the kitchen behind the counter instead of here. I've died here so often because the ghost comes all the way back here and then just sees you and then you're done so. Um, what? Wait a second, those are on... I think the glass is there, the book is there. Um. Or both. These are some fourth walls, and the hiding spot is of course here. The hiding spot is good, but the ghost seems to be here. So, what? <laughs> Damn. Or it could be in here because I haven't seen any breath. Breath, breath, breath. No. Boop. That's interesting. Where's that bone? Oh, there you are. Finally, it took forever. Okay, um, let's check the garage for hiding spots. And please, Ghosty, please, for the love of God, leave. Yes, the good hiding spot. Please, leave the breaker alone, please. I think I've jinxed it. Um, let me think, what do we bring in? bring in this? Let's check because I haven't seen any breath. It could be in the hallway too, it could have been interacting through the wall. So I don't see... What was that? I don't know what that was supposed to be. Oh yeah, that's going down in here for sure. That doesn't cover much, but okay. Daddy, no. What was that noise? It sounded weird. It sounded almost like the tripod being knocked over, but somehow not. I I have no idea. Okay, grab these. So now we're gonna set up everything. We have to set up sandals for sure. Anything? No? As long as you don't turn on the radio, I'm totally fine, ghosty. 
Let's put one here in case it wants to worm towards my location. Yeah, that that goes a bit upwards, but it works. It works. It's because you can't place them in the door frame, unfortunately. I don't know why. On Willow, it just doesn't work. Don't ask me why. <laughs> I think you have to ask Lavender for that. I'm not sure. Maybe. Hmm. Okay. So we can keep an eye on those while we're setting up everything and see if it follows us. And we're also going to hear the salt being disturbed. Um, let's see. We need this. We need this. I'm going to set up the hiding spot real quick. I'll be back. Okay, the ghost hasn't done much so far. It hasn't walked out of the room. Interesting. Okay, it's still in here. It's not a wave. Because it has stepped into the salt. I think I'm gonna put all of those in here. Camera is here, EMF is there. Let's keep them together. Um, let me think what else. We can place a camera outside of the room just to watch that door from outside. We can also mark the hiding spot. Oh, this EMF needs to go over there. Let's leave one candle there. Let's grab that camera and one candle for now. We can bring the others later back in. Just in case it's a UA. And this here, just in case I have to hide here, which could be possible. And this for later. Okay. It's not doing much when the lights are on. Let's turn them off and see what happens. Grab our smudge. Where's the smudge? Where's the smudge? Where did I leave it? Uh oh. I'm insane. It immediately does something. Did I leave it here? Oh, it's here. Okay, as you can see, I've already set up Poltergeist. I mean, I can extend that a little bit. Let's do it like that. A nice line. Whoop. It hasn't wormed towards me yet. Let's leave that a bit open. That looks cool with that blue light. <laughs> okay. I can start with those. This ghost is not doing much. It's so quiet. Show us. Give us a sign. Are you here? Show us. Are you here? Is it even in here? I mean, it has to, right? We can see our breath. Step out of the room. Are you ashamed? Oh my god, it immediately does something. Does that count, please? Yes, it did. Okay, let's wait. Nothing more? No? I won't take that photo because they don't work. But unfortunately, you can't rule out Mare anymore with that. But, which is weird, it also prevents you from using the spirit box. You don't get any response if that thing is on. I don't know why. No. Nope. I don't think you're a shade and I don't think you're a noni. And of course, you're not a wave. Unfortunately, that was not a normal turn off the light it was an airball event i hate airball events because you can take photos of them you are not a gin okay i should have grabbed the camera uh, if it hunts now i'm gonna be dead down here because there's no hiding spot down here bad rng bad 
I mean, put away that hiding spot in the left bedroom and give me that one down here. It would be totally perfect. The one in the ghost room, nice. The one in the garage, nice. My favorite hiding spots, but the one over there, unnecessary. No one needs that. Okay, did you touch that door again? Okay, so we can roll out gin as well. The open would be nice. You can loop it all over the place. <laughs> Ghost, are you here? I have to check my sanity because I want to be able to rule out shade. Let's quickly do that. Okay, we are at 80%. I mean, we were at 90% then before the air ball hit, it, hit us. So not a shade for sure. We can check for orbs. Camera still standing. Nice. So in case you complain about uh, the tiny display you have on these, just do it old school like OG Fasmo. Place them and look here because this screen is always gonna be the same size. Just as easy as that. <laughs> but I don't see any orbies. I can check that later because sometimes they are floating around wherever i think i'm gonna bring in a second candle and a third one we get one outside of the room which is good i could actually reignite those candles with that candle out there as long as the ghost doesn't blow it out seriously again okay now it has turned on that computer again and the radio. Oh, I know back in the days when ghosts were playing around with electronics a lot. And you, everyone was like, oh, it has to be a gin. It loves to play around with electronics. Where's that interaction? Where? The notebook? Thank you. Hope they both count. Yes, they do. Let's see. Can I do this? Can I just... Eh. It works with the lanterns, but not with the candles. Damn it. Feels like this ghost is more active when the lights are off, but that applies for any ghost, actually. Okay, uh, EMF, get back here. I want to I want you to be there. We can take photos of the candles. And the ghost blows them out. Yeah, I could take that photo, but I think I'm gonna take a photo of the candles. More reliable because I can watch them now. So that was one blowout. This one is still lit. <coughs> so use the candles that are in the house. You can use them. They can help you. With the matches, I don't use them in the beginning, but the moment I got the tier 2 lighter, I usually light all the candles in the house that are stationary, because uh, if the ghost is nearby, the only way that candle extinguishes is when the ghost blows them off, and then you know, okay, wait, I've lit that, so the ghost must be nearby. Where did I leave my camera? I hope it's a three star like that. Okay, it wasn't too far away. Great. Thanks, Ghosty. Much appreciated. I just need a photo of you. Would you please stop doing those stupid airball ghost events and give me a real ghost event? You are an Onrio, huh? Hello, Mr. Onrio. Oh, what a coincidence, huh? Having the candle objective and... Uh, the ghost being an Onrio? Oh my god, that's insane. <laughs> that's so cool. Okay, so as long as the candles are lit, we should be fine. I'm gonna leave that here. You know what I'm gonna do in case it does a ghost event in there, which could be quite possible. I'm gonna grab another candle, this one. And if the ghost decides to do a ghost event here, I'm just gonna light it. I hope it leaves the breaker alone. I mean, I can start hunting. 
I can show you why it's under Mourinho because it has blown out the candles and it has tried to hunt right after that. I should be inside if it wants to hunt again. It, I have to be in the house when it blows out the candles. So the range of a candle for the Unreal is the range of a tier 2 crucifix and look at the sanity. As I've expected we have high sanity. So it has to be an Unreal and I'm gonna die because of that stupid ghost photo, I know that. So let's check the candles. They have to be lit. If it blows it out now, it can initiate a hunt. Let's see. Uh, give me this one. So as long as I have a candle, I should be fine. And light it. Oh yeah, you blew them both. Uh, this one has one out. Okay. So it can't hunt here, it can't hunt here, it can't hunt there. It has to blow them out first. I could wait for the grace period and immediately take a photo the moment I see the light flickering. Count down two seconds and take a photo immediately because... Oh! Hey buddy, thank you very much, that's much appreciated. Did it count? Let's check. Yeah, sometimes they don't count. Here, I got something for you. Look at this. Look at this buddy, huh? You like that? Mr. Anuio? <laughs> Sorry, I'm teasing the ghost a bit. You like that? It can start a hunt from there if it blows it out. Come on, do it. Come on. It went back to its room. Come on, boy, I want you to hunt. No! Stop this airball shenanigans! I hate airballs. They don't do anything. You can't take a photo of that. I hope they, they're they gonna implement that, that an airball counts as a photo. So I left it with a candle there. So it can blow it out and initiate a hunt. Come on, Ghosty, please do that. Otherwise, I... There we go. But here! Hey, hey, hey! Wrong way! <laughs> okay. And that's the Unreal. <laughs> Can't believe I figured out an Unreal with those crappy tier 1 candles. Nice! Oh, you didn't like those, huh? Oh. You're angry, ghosty. Oh, don't be sad. Look, Ghosty, I got a gift for you. I'm gonna leave that for you. <laughs> looky, looky, what I get for you. I got so many candles for you. I leave them all. You can have them all. Look at this here. This one. And oh, this one is still lit. Oh, this one is broken. This one is broken, but I'm look, this is for you. That's my goodbye gift for you, okay? Here. Nice and cozy. Good night. <laughs> uh, you can turn off the lights. I'm gonna leave them on in case you need to go to the bathroom again. I wanted to go to the bathroom. Maybe uh, he was afraid of me? Maybe? Am I that creepy? I mean... I don't have a problem if I look creepy. <laughs> That's totally fine for me. I like to be creepy. At least people leave me alone then. <laughs> the ghosts, there's no need to be afraid of me. I'm just here to help you, ghosties. Welcome back. There's some <laughs> jobs ready for you. Okay. Nice little Onwayo. I left him with a cozy, nice bedroom, so he should be grateful. <laughs> I left the lights on so you can go to the bathroom if he needs to. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I've done the uh, the ghost type weekly. Oh my god, it's Tuesday and I've already done 15. I've identified 15 ghosts. Of course, like um, five of them were challenge mode ghosts. And the challenge mode this week was easy. It was. I mean, it wasn't easy. The difficulty in the challenge mode is uh, to find the ghost room. But to identify the ghost, it was easy. 
That's what I'm saying. Yay, tier 2! 30 meter range! Thank you! I appreciate that. Anything else? Because sometimes it doesn't pop up if there's something new. This I've just unlocked this recently. Uh, these I wanna keep them. Uh, yeah, 37. I want this! I wish I can at least take one item into the next leveling process after proceeding. That would be so cool if I can decide, hey, you know what, I wanna keep the tier 3 lanterns and next time I proceed, like, okay, you can either take them again or you can choose something else. That would be cool to bring that over, you know. I mean, you start with no money anyways, you can't buy them right away on your first go, but after your second go or first go, you can buy them and you have the lanterns, that would be great. So we are at 31, still a way to go, a long way to go. Let's see, how often has it used its ability? Twice. So I think uh, one was when... I tried to hunt and use the crucifix after blowing out those candles and the second one was when it actually was able to hunt. Quickly check. Oop, done. Done. Weekly's done. It's Tuesday, by the way. <laughs> okay. So yeah, I hope you liked it. See you in the next one. Bye.